From VOA Learning English, this is the Health Report. If asked what was the most important health story of 2014, there would be little debate. Ebola has killed more than 8,000 people and infected more than 20,000. These numbers come from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention in the U.S and the World Health Organization. But this is not the first time the world has heard of Ebola. Every 10 years or so, it would appear in African villages and kill people. The Ebola outbreak that began in 2014 is very different than all that came before. This time, Ebola sickened thousands of people in West Africa. The Ebola outbreak began in rural Guinea, spread to the capital, and crossed into Sierra Leone and Liberia. Misunderstanding, miscommunication, and fear grew with the number of cases. Governments answered that fear by putting infected people in restricted areas. But they also increased education efforts. Today, health workers continue to go door to door looking for possible cases. Ebola has shown the weaknesses in healthcare systems in some of the affected countries. VOA Learning English spoke to a doctor who got Ebola while working with HIV AIDS patients in Liberia. Dr. Rick Sakra says a broken health care system is the biggest issue in Ebola affected areas. But there is progress in efforts to fight the disease. French researchers are developing an Ebola test to provide results in 15 minutes. The current Ebola test takes 24 hours. Japan and the U.S. are also working on faster tests, and Swiss researchers are trying to develop a vaccine to prevent Ebola. For VOA Learning English, I'm Carolyn Prasuti.